Hello guys, you're welcome to the channel. My name is Yao Asim Pisetre and this is Ashko TV, the official YouTube channel for Acida House Commodities and the agribusiness channel you can rely on for all agribusiness information. Alright, so today it's been like three weeks, almost three weeks that we came to plant our maize here on the maize farm. And we have not had constant rains. Okay, so this is one of the challenges you have when you decide to go with natural rains. The best thing, the best option you, you could have gone for is to have to have your own irrigation system in your farm. And we understand that, we all understand that that is very expensive. So it is not doing so bad but if we had had like two three times of rainfall it would have been better than this all right okay so that is why i'm here today but there is uh, an inquiry that i had that i want to address for all of us to to get take note of now we are in what may we are in the month of may and i had an inquiry that okay so if you have not planted yet if is it too late to plant in may is it too late to plant your maize in the month of may that's the inquiry that i had okay and this is it we are in the month of may originally we are supposed to have planted as far back as march okay we are supposed to have planted as far back as March of this year. Okay, now, for some reasons, you might not have been able to plant, you know, since the month of, you know, March, April, and this month of May. Okay, now, some of the reasons might include the fact that you were not able to, you were not able to clear your land on time. Also, maybe you didn't have enough rains to say you would plant. Maybe you have cleared your land, you've prepared your land, but you have you don't have but you don't have enough rains to say you're planting. Okay, that's one of the reasons. Now, there's something that I have said on this channel, and I want to repeat this same thing. What I said was depending on your area, depending on the area where the land is, it might not be too late to say you are planting in May. This is because the rainfall patterns differ from places to places. So one thing that I've always been been telling my clients, my friends, subscribers who have been calling me about maize farming is that don't leave the people, the indigents in the villages where your land is located. Don't leave, don't leave them. Take their word. Talk to them. Listen to them. Okay. It might be that all the information that you have had or most of the information that you have had about maize farming and maize you know planting seasons does not even apply to the place where your land is you understand it could even be that per the rainfall patterns of the place where your land is you are now even going to have rains okay it could even be that you are now even going to have rains in that in that area okay so it will so not be you know bad to plant in may all right so what our advice in this situation is that speak with the people who farm on the on in the area that you are going to farm okay and they might be able to tell you that okay as per the as per you know the rainfall patterns of this place it's not too late to plant or as per the rainfall pattern of this place it is too late to have planted because mind you what we also what we also do uh, you know around this part of the country is that we have two seasons we have the major season and the minor season okay now you don't want to plant in a in in a period that will jeopardize your chances of planting your minor season let me repeat this you don't want to plant in a period that will jeopardize your chances of planting your minor season. 
your minor season crop because if you should plant in May, you should be looking at how many months, three, four months, and maybe four and a half months until you have harvested your major season. And if you, you, you want to consider, you know, um, growing maize in, your, in the minor season on the same land, then you might, you, you might be looking at harvesting your maize in July or August. By which time, if you should plant now, you may not be able to what? To harvest during that time. And what will happen is that you won't be able to, to plant for your minor season. So, once again, get back to the people who live close to or who live around the places that your land is. Ask them about the rainfall pattern. You might even you might want to do your own research and get your grain variety, your maize variety that you want to plant and all those things, your fertilizer and all those things. But get to know about, you know, the rainfall, the weather conditions of the place that you're going to farm. It's very important. All right. So thank you until we meet in the next one. It's bye-bye for now.